going to a wedding tomorrow and I have to wear a sari. So I shoot all videos on my own, you guys. But now I give all the pep talks to everybody. And it looks so pretty, right? Hello, you guys. Good morning. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. If you're new to my channel, hi, I'm Akanksha. I literally just woke up, but it is 12 o'clock. And I just thought I'll film what I'm going to do today. Today I have a couple of things to do. So first of all, I need to take my, um, you know, I need to wash my hair because uh, I don't have time later. It's already anyways, 12 o'clock. So, and today is Friends Reunion. So I'm watching Friends with my friends uh, just for fun. So uh, I'm going to first wash my hair so that, you know, it meanwhile dries by the time I finish watching friends then I can blow dry and start shooting so today I'm shooting the last five uh, you know outfits last four outfits one outfit I'll shoot later so last four outfits of um, the outfit series so I'm very excited about that and yeah that's going to be my day I don't know what it's going to be but let's find out Oh my god you guys just got done watching are my cheeks are literally painting i've laughed i've cried i've screamed i've clapped i've done everything the show was so beautiful i can't even explain my cheeks are painting because such a beautiful beautiful show oh my god justin bieber was spunning i'm like ah Oh my god, such a beautiful, beautiful show. I watched it with two of my friends and so beautiful. I literally, my jaw, my cheeks are painting. I am so, I think this is a refresher which people needed during these shitty times. So this is uh, Z5 where I was watching friends and here my friends were on video call. We were watching together. It was so beautiful. But my mom though was constantly asking me to come and eat. I was like, I'm not eating today. It's too 20. I should go have my lunch now. But man, this show so pretty. Like so... Okay, hi you guys. About to start doing my makeup, but before that, I did want to talk about today's sponsor, which is Carmesi. So, a couple of days ago, I got done with my periods, and the day I got my periods, coincidentally, I posted the menstrual cup video as well. And when I did post that video, there are a lot of people who texted me and DM me saying, like, how nice it is that I'm speaking about this, or they're like, how how are you able to talk about periods so openly? I just want to say one thing: we are in 2021. We have to normalize periods i mean it's already quite sad that we have to normalize it because it's already very normal but there is a stigma attached and first of all i could never understand the concept or the secrecy behind periods of a topic of a thing which literally happens to every woman like every woman who has a uterus unless you're like menopause you are bleeding i mean there is it is so so uh, normalized so i don't even understand the secrecy or anything behind it i've been very comfortable talking about it always so the next time when you talk about periods don't shy away say it as it is if it makes the other person comfortable it is their problem it is not a you problem unless you feel comfortable with it other person is not going to feel comfortable with it so always remember that so talking about periods i've shifted to menstrual cup a few months ago i've spoken about this in on the in the other video as well and i told you how much i like this cup so this is the kamesi cup this is in the size medium size medium fits me perfectly uh, they they have three different sizes although they are small medium and large small is for teenagers and medium is for like women in 20s and larger ones are for women who have given vaginal birth now i did chop away this bottom part which is little which was a little longer so it's usually this longer but i did chop it away because it was too long for me and i did not need it if you're somebody who has like a longer cervix you might need it for me this is perfectly fine honestly menstrual cups have changed the game for me i've never been so comfortable on my period like i i literally am not even conscious about periods these days like unless i have cramps i forget about it and sometimes i have to remember myself ki, oh, I have periods. I need to change the cup and which is only like every 8 to 12 hours you don't have to change it that frequently 
frequently as well. I've put so many people on menstrual cup after I've tried a menstrual cup because I also used to be scared previously. But now I gave all the pep talks to everybody and I gave so many people there and so many people tried it and it makes me really happy. So if you're try if you're looking for a menstrual cup, I would highly recommend this Carmesi one. It's a really nice soft cup. It's extremely comfortable. It's eco-friendly. The Carmesi cup is made of 100% biocompatible medical grade silicone. The best part, bro, it's just rupees 550 and it lasts up to 10 years imagine how much money you're going to save if you just buy one cup so this cup actually comes in a cotton pouch which i don't have right now so once i'm done using it i just sanitize it and store it and once i again have to use it i remove it from it and sanitize and use again i just boil it in water for like five minutes before i use it and then i insert it if you do want like you know to know more details and more like technical stuff about the cup then definitely check the video i posted a few weeks ago so if you do want to check out this cup then i leave the link to this in the description but i even have a code akanksha six i'll put that on the screen as well if you use that code you'll get 20 percent discount so imagine you'll get it even lesser than 550 they are available on other sites like amazon etc as well but the code only works on the carmacy website just in case you want to use it i'm putting that information out there so yeah now i'm about to do my makeup and get shooting i do have to shoot four outfits today one more thing is there but i think that like traditional one which i'll you know shoot uh, couple of uh, daily, days later or tomorrow or something so I have to get started because it's already four o'clock and I need to get shooting. So, so this day took a very unexpected turn. I had so much to do but I still did not do anything yet and it is 12.15 in the night okay by the way. So I got done watching friends. I was like really happy, super super pumped and uh, so I blow dried it, did my makeup, did one video and there was a session. I don't know why things took a lot of time today. So almost like 6 o'clock, 6.30, I was done with my makeup. I shot a video, edited it and uh, there was a clubhouse invite. So there's a new, uh, you know, world of clubhouse which I've been introduced to. And I there was like a room which Ankush, Deep, Vagera, all the makeup lovers created and I joined. Like that started at 8.30, I thought half an hour chalega. Then that went on till what, 11.30 you guys, 9.30, 10.30, 11.30, 3.00 ghante. That room was going on. I stopped uh, like, you know, filming and I was listening to it because it was quite, very, very interesting. And you know, it was like really nice to have like a common set of people whose uh, common interest is makeup so it was beautiful to be in that but i in that chakkar i forgot to upload today's video so around 10 o'clock i realized like oh shit i did not upload today's video so basically the instagram otd which i was supposed to upload today and then i uploaded that and now 11 30 it's done so i just changed into another outfit to film this look it's a beautiful co-op set you will see this on my instagram so follow this on my follow me on my instagram it's an akanksha komireli so it looks like this is not going to be a day in my life vlog again so it will be again random things Akanksha does, I guess. So, anyways, I'm about to film. So, you will see what I do. I shoot all videos on my own, you guys. So, people usually ask, like, you know, is anybody helping you with the fashion videos, etc. I'm not saying I'm like the lights, cameraman, producer, director, editor, uh, actor, anything else. I'm doing everything. So, my camera is right there. I am standing right here. I do have, like, my uh, laptop, which is connected let me just show you the laptop can see what actually my camera can see so this is my setup so even if i'm standing like right there i can see what is going on right here so this is how i shoot so i just have to like whenever i want to focus or unfocus i have a zoom lens so like i focus unfocus with this and i shoot with this for now so right now the lights are off so i'm going to switch off the, on the lights okay it got really really far. i would have fell down not only that this stand would have fell down oh my god too many things would have happened now oh this chair goes out of the way i was supposed to get done with shooting at 10 o'clock and i'm starting at 12 o'clock i don't know how long this night is gonna go but Really cute, neutral, quad. So like I said, I shoot 
all by myself and it can get really boring to just like you know shoot all by myself for a lot of hours so something which helps me is music so i just play music and start shooting <laughs> So literally for like a 30 second video or even 20-25 second I shoot like each one for half an hour because you're not sure when you'll get the like right bit. Some bits might be useful, some might not be useful. So I almost have like footage of 20-25 minutes of each thing and it takes 20-25 minutes for me to like put an outfit together. So you know it's easily like 45 minutes to one hour for me to shoot each outfit. I need to shoot three more today. Not sure how far the live, um, the club, you know, what do you say, the night will go, but this is pretty much a little bit of BTS. So, yeah, I have a lot of things to do the next couple of days, and um, hopefully, I'll get this done today so that I don't have like because tomorrow I have to post a YouTube video, Saturday I have something else, and I want to get this done and get over with it so that I can actually concentrate on the other content because it has been like you know very burning me out a lot because posting every single day is not a piece of cake and like you know it's like for me it's I've not even been having off days a lot because you know I it's like I should shoot fashion videos then I'll be like oh I need to make makeup content then I shoot again and I'm like oh I have to make content for YouTube then I have to do like this and it's like I've been shooting constantly every single day so today I thought I'll get done with this fashion thing and not do it for like at least one week later maybe like if i want to create content again i will uh, but for now i'll just get done with this and concentrate more on like you know makeup videos or um you know youtube videos because i've not been doing that as well as i like them to you know be um so yeah tonight i'm going to be done with this hopefully hello you guys so i just got done shooting this beautiful look for youtube i have to shoot like the outfit part i just shot the makeup part yet and it looks so pretty right i mean i've not dressed up like full typical south indian in a really really long time easily over two years because last one year there was quarantine Uske pehle i didn't even go anywhere so this is the outfit, it looks super pretty. Okay, so this, let me just fix this a minute. Okay, so this is the outfit. I've not worn this. Like, I think I just wore this once after my mom bought this for me. And wearing this literally the second time. So pretty. So I'm just waiting for my mom's search, like for a waist chain so that it just looks really nice and snatched but yaar so pretty I know I'm like obsessed with myself like what can I do everybody should be obsessed with their own selves I don't know my hair is not fixed properly like I don't want to show you from behind but from front it looks decent and that's all it matters probably guys like you look very nice I mean in her own language like if I'm asking do I look nice she's like yes and that's more than enough validation for me for this point, I think so. Hi you guys, so I just got done filming one video for Instagram, I actually filmed something else and then I did this, so looks very pretty right, like I know I wore this in the other vlog as well, but can you guess, like this is why you should not trust Instagram, look at me, I didn't even wear the top, I didn't even wear anything. I have the bottoms of something else, top of something else. I just put dupatta, pinned it, put some earrings, and made this Indian. Did you see that? Yes. So, don't believe everything you see on Instagram. But, my makeup though. 
you can believe this so pretty let me show you properly this is how my makeup looks who else loves sweet corn i love boiled sweet corn mom usually like separates it but you know sometimes we just put in everything together because it's so much fun to eat it like this she just put salt like but if you like butter etc you can put butter on this and it tastes really nice as well just watching bojack horseman resting a little bit and having my sweet corn all right hello guess who's a vaccinated baby i hope i don't have a lot of symptoms because tomorrow i have to go out one of my friend is getting married like all of us were like we were not supposed to go there because it was just going to be like five to six people so but her mom actually felt really sick very suddenly not because of covid but something else and uh, she was very adamant about she getting married so she is getting married without her mom her mom is admitted in the hospital and literally there's nobody else there around her so only like at least three five six friends will be there so that's the reason we that's the reason you know we are going for the wedding and hopefully i don't have symptoms like if i do feel really sick i might not go but i really want to okay so i like it all i'm going to a wedding tomorrow and i have to wear a sari i was not like i mean i didn't even know i was going to it until like the day before yesterday so i did not even prep for any outfit or anything and the bride really wants us to wear something old fashioned like you know like a 90s or 80s sari like a patu sari and um, you know something in that vibe i don't have anything so i'm just looking at my mom's options she's showing me sarees so these are few options this is one this is one i really like this one this one is too too heavy so i'm not sure if this is not like a blouse of this it's these are just random blouse this is the blouse of this sari this is the blouse of this sari idi baan di gaan nit kan de kitne wala yes ko mention white and red kan pehli ko to white and red esk de mujhe mala yes बट पर्पल बॉन्ड ना कि कलर बॉन्ड अच्छा है अंदर पिस कलर है रेस को मस्त हो पहले कुदर ना दे अंतर ना पहले कुदर वाइट एस कुटे इतना है ना नहीं कुटे वाइट एस कुटे इतना फोटो आम भी साम के चूस चल रही है इधर ब्लाउज दाने हाई नेक का सो दिस वन आई एम एक्चुअली थिंकिंग बिकॉज़ आई डू हैव लाइक अ सिल्वर ब्लाउज बेस it is of a lehenga which has like ruffled sleeves so it kind of will look good on that or else if i have to wear my warms everything is like you know full sleeved etc i mean it does go with the vibe of this olden times but it does not look so good on me so this is one option this is another option which you just showed which is actually really nice white and red this really looks like olden times but i don't know if i really want to wear white tomorrow and the another option is what this one like i told you blue and orange is also really cool this one to i think i'll have to wear this only if i wear this so we are yet to decide why is it so zoomed in okay let me put wide angle this is better yes so these are the options hello next day good morning it's around 8:30 i just got done getting ready can you sir please and i was about to leave so i just thought i'll show you my uh outfit what i'm wearing so i ended up wearing another saree which is my mom's saree so this is this saree is like 31 years old she wore the saree on her reception and it kafi looks like you know pretty old style and i wore a top on it this is my generally like you know general top it's like it's like a, a shirt uh which i just you know wore it as a blouse i just tucked it inside and i wore it as a blouse because anything else was not suiting it and but one problem with this is because it's t-shirt material it's kind of you know sagging down a little bit but it does look nice i paired them with these earrings and it looks decent i didn't want to put my hair open uh, but then i thought if it, i leave it open it will get very chic chic so my mom just braided this part and just put it like this i'm not sure how to show you guys this is my outfit so it's like an olden day saree with a newer generation styling so this is how my saree looks it is very very pretty literally 31 years old can you imagine and yeah i wore a top earrings i'm wearing these bangles a watch and i'm going to take a bag as well i'm probably going to take that one just in case i would not need it but you know just to put like lipsticks or gara 
and yeah i did like this so proper nude brownish type of makeup which looks really pretty i wanted to do something else with makeup but i ended up doing this and it's okay it's not like the greatest thing but i do like how it looks like this you know collar thing actually gives that very olden 80s 90s vibe with this sari so that's the reason i wore this i do have like another golden blouse which i wanted to wear which is like gold a uh, sleeveless one uh, but this one is little more brassy gold and that one is more like white gold and it was not suiting and it was not giving that you know little olden days vibes so i just wore this collar one and it looks pretty decent i think people are roaming every day only i am sitting at home ye se distal peru ayyo sorry sorry da mai sir ko ki no Okay, hi. I came back from the wedding. I just took bath. The wedding was so so beautiful. It was so intimate and actually really beautiful. Uh ah mom is calling me to eat because i literally do not even eat there like we have a lockdown in hyderabad until one like until one you can do anything you want but by the time it's one you have to come back home like everybody stays quite far and they need like an hour distance travel to go so everybody had to leave so i also uh left uh, so we were there until like the wedding just got over and then we started from there we did not even eat so my mom is constantly calling me to um eat and i have to go eat now but yeah it is the weekend four is here